Professional Candy Crush competitor and former league champion Braden Sullivan, more famously known as Sodomize, is suing current league champion Tony for $10,000 and for repossession of the coveted Candy Cup Championship Trophy. Sodomize claims that Tony sabotaged the competition by removing his shoes and socks during gameplay, incurring a big yikes from spectators and competitors alike. When reached for comment before taping, Tony had this to say. I don't really know why this kid is suing me. I just really like playing Candy Crush as much as I like a nice gabagoo. All right, this is the case of Brayden Sodomai Sullivan versus Tony. Let's go ahead and get this started. Mr. Sullivan, here's your day in court. Let's begin. All right. Everyone agrees with me, you know, about the foot shit. It's weird and creepy. Nobody likes it. I am standing here, Your Honor, as the only person ballsy enough to come forward about this guy and what exactly is ballsy about suing another person for winning a race it's not a race it's a competition okay and there should be a level of respect that comes along with it this homie doesn't get it he just showed up out of the blue he takes his fucking shoes off and he doesn't care the smell is making everyone gag around him might I ask, why are you the only person willing to come forward? They didn't care. They told me to let it go. And that it's just a game. But this isn't just a game, Your Honor. I mean, are making sick plays in Call of Duty just a game? I think not. Candy Crush means something. This competition means something. People like Tony coming in. Screwing up shit just because they can, it makes me sick. Your Honor, may I respond to this? Go ahead, Mr. Tony. Tony, is it? Yeah, just Tony. So, I downloaded this game on my phone, and I am good at it. Sue me. Now, I got this kid breathing down my neck. I play games with my shoes off. It's more comfortable. Sue me. He is. He wants that trophy thing. He can have it. He can have the $10,000 though. See, Judge? He doesn't even care. It means nothing to him. Calm down. There's no need to get emotional here. Tony, Mr. Sullivan is stating that you sabotaged the competition. How would I do that, Your Honor? It's a Candy Crush game! Uh, he knows what he did, and you're starting to piss me off. I have oh. proof. I have proof. Mr. Sullivan, this is a courtroom. Please remain from speaking unless I ask you a question or I prompt you to speak. But you don't understand! He's lying! He keeps lying! Tony, any idea what he could be referring to? None, Your Honor! Come on! Mr. Sullivan. Actually, ma'am. Would you mind calling me by my gamer tag, Sodomize? Sodomize. Yeah, because I see the demise of all of my enemies. Sodomize. Can you explain your case against Tony to the court? And quite frankly, to me too, because this is almost the most ridiculous thing that I've heard all day. Bet. Come on! Bet. Okay, Tony's feet stink. He obviously oh. took his shoes off because he knew he'd reek up the place. That's how he played dirty. Listen, Your Honor. Please. I smell my feet every day. My wife don't got no problems. 
Nobody said anything to me on that day. You think that it would have been brought up if it was any kind of big deal, right? Like, why would they let me play if it wasn't a big deal? I have here, Your Honor, the arena rules about what's allowed during competition and what isn't. And there isn't anything in there about being shoeless. Uh, you have evidence? Yes, thank you very much, Your Honor. Here it is. As you can see, there's a big bunch of, there's a big bunch of tests here. It's a big old wall of text. Uh, it's a TLDR. It's a too long and to read, but you can tell if you press Control F and you search the documents. There's nothing in there about taking your shoes off. Okay. All right. Oh. All right. Um, I'm seeing some people in the um the court that don't understand it here. This is my um I this is my esports logo. Um, as you see, saw demise. Um, it's a nice logo. A thank nice you, logo. thank you. I hired um someone at Fiverr to do it for me. Um, got it to me real quick. I can shoot at you a DM with their information. But you know what, Tony? Um, you just don't you don't have any respect for the esports world. Oh, what? Yeah. I got nothing but respect for the esports world. So, Your Honor, um, yes, he's showing, you know, part of the bylaw where, you know, it doesn't say you can't have your shoes off, but here is the evidence in the bylaws that say you can't willingly sabotage a competition. Okay? And my argument today is Tony knew that he had a foot condition. Tony knew that his foot were, feet were going to stink. Tony knew when he took his shoes off that it was going to cause a smell throughout the so, whole arena that we couldn't even focus on our Candy Crush gameplay. Okay. So, do you have any more evidence to explain that, you know, he knew he had a foot condition or... I do, Your Honor. And I can't tell you how I got it. But here is a doctor's note from Tony's doctor stating that he had a foot condition. Tony knew. Objection, Your Honor. This is a violation of doctor-patient confidentiality. Oh, okay. So I have several questions right now. Yes. Um, I have prescribed an antifungal what? Um, I don't know, Your Honor. I wasn't the doctor that wrote this note. Um, so what is the doctor's name? Um, I, th again, Your Honor, I, I don't know. That would be um, a question for Tony, um, seeing as how this is his doctor's note, and he has explaining to do. It's so Dr. you can't say how no you got it? To the more famous one. So you, but you can't tell me how you got this evidence of his, his I doctor? I cannot, Your Honor. I cannot. You know, you realize that this is a court of law, and you are sworn to tell the truth. While you're in here, did you forge this document? I did not forge this document, Your Honor. Um, I have some friends on um, the 4chan servers that helped me to undig this. But I personally did not acquire it. Um, it was given to me. To you by whom? Legally legal means. Um, I, I cannot say this is like a deep throat situation, Your Honor. Sounds like you know a I'm guy who knows a guy. I'm not allowed to reveal my sources. Sounds mm. like you know a guy who knows a guy. Maybe uh, I do, Tony. Maybe I do know a guy that knows a guy. You don't get this as far sounds as very I do questionable. in the esports industry not knowing some guys. Well, you certainly don't get as far as you have of being good at Candy Crush. Oh! I oh. was last year's league champion! All right, so this is very questionable still, but let's continue. Any other questionable or legitimate evidence do we have? Any of that? Anyone? Look, how about, how about, how about the picture of my feet just days before the competition, huh? To dispel this myth that my feet, look, look, look at the perfect pedicure on these feet. Oh, they're beautiful. I like to do the black uh, toenails because uh, Tony, that obviously I was looks a goth in high school. And I Your like Honor, to have a that is an obvious photoshopped um, 
No, image. no, I got my toenails painted, painted black right now. I was yeah, a in high school, and so I like to, to paint my toenails black. Well, yeah, that uh, is also Honor, questionable evidence as well. Correct, Your Honor. I, um, I'm telling you, Tony here knew what he was doing um, when he entered that competition. I didn't know nothing. Off. I didn't know nothing. Okay, so there's been some some definitely questionable evidence brought up by both sides. Or wait, no. Yeah, by both sides. And we're going to dismiss the evidence that is questionable. If you can't tell me the source in a court of law where you got it from, then we're not going to deal with it because, frankly, it seems very suspect. Um... Does anyone have it's any closing true, arguments that you would like to provide? In civil. I just said civil. If you're going to yell, your argument is done already. Yes, Your Honor. Okay. I want to say this one thing. Esports com competition, gaming means everything to me. Okay? He, like, it means everything. I hold this deer. And for someone like Tony to come in and just make a mockery of everything that me and my friends, like, you know, bearded bro and, you know, especially like my oh, squad, you're still talking. my okay. squad, mm. it, 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 it's, it's appalling. Well, you know what, Your Honor, he may hold gaming dear to himself. But I hold the candy cup dear to me. You don't oh, deserve to hit. You don't deserve to touch I'm the one that's holding that it. It's a candy cup. Right. And I'm the owner. Because you you're a loser. But that's okay. We're just here to have fun. Am I right, Your Honor? Um, yeah, so after listening to both sides, the court is going to side with Tony. Sodomize, oh. you have some issues. You are a sore loser. This and is I feel not bad right, for you. Your Honor. He Thank you, it. Your Honor. He knew it. This Your case Honor. is closed. You don't deserve to hold the cup. Your Honor, you don't deserve to hold the cup. Look, look, do you, you, you want to hold the cup? Is that what you want? Do you just want to hold the cup? You can hold the cup if you want. In fact, you can have the cup. Yeah, you can just have the cup. It's no problem. I will there you take go. it. And I might I add, Your Honor, you're looking very beautiful today. Oh, thank you. All right, that's the last case in the docket, and someone's going home with some change in their pocket. Please like and subscribe and follow Nerdy Curve and Goldilocks and the Bear on Twitch. We'll see you next time on Judgment Court.